we're here at the Embassy Suites for Claire and Matt's wedding. I think everybody's doing well. The bride may be a little sweaty, but other than that, very excited. We've all got our hair and makeup done, and we're getting ready to go. We have our coffee and mimosas and Jimmy John's to keep us over till the wedding. And it's a really good environment. I think everyone's really excited and happy to be here. When your legs don't work like they used to before And I can't sweep you off of your feet Will your mouth still remember the taste of my love? Will your eyes still smile from your cheek? Darling, I will be loving you Baby, my heart could still fall less Heart at 23 And I'm thinking about how people fall. Well, I guess I'm ready. Um, I feel very calm, except like Kathleen said, I'm a little sweaty. But um, everything's fine. Like we, yesterday we, we actually said all of our vows and so, um, we might be technically married right now, but so which makes things a lot less stressful. So, um, yes, we're ready. So, honey, now take me into your loving arms. Kiss me under the light of a thousand stars. Today's the day, man. That's crazy. Place your head on my feet and heart. Oh yeah, I already got their bow tie on. Suited and booted. Yeah. Uh, right right hey Claire, this is your soon-to-be husband Matt. Just wanted to say how much I love you and how much I've been looking forward to this day for my whole life. Uh, we've shared a lot of great memories together. I'm looking forward to sharing a lot more and I can't wait to spend the rest of my life with you. I love you Claire. Cause honey your soul could never grow Baby, your smile's forever in my mind and memory I'm thinking about how people fall in love in mysterious ways Maybe it's all part of a plan well, I'll just keep on making the Well, right now I'm very jittery, even though like I'm not questioning my decisions. It's just a really big thing, and I, it's a lot to take in, and it's like one of your biggest steps ever. And so, I'm just trying to keep myself together so my makeup doesn't run, <laughs> and I need tissues. I love you, Matt. I am excited. I'm gonna be here for you, baby. I'll be a man of my word. Speak the language in a voice that you have never heard. Brothers and sisters, strive eagerly for the greatest spiritual gifts, but I shall show you a still more excellent way. If I speak in human and angelic tongues, but do not have love, I am a resounding gong or a clashing cymbal. Love is patient, love is kind, it is not jealous, it is not pompous, it is not inflated, it is not rude, it does not seek its own interests, it is not quick-tempered, it does not brood over injury, it does not rejoice over wrongdoing, 
but rejoices with the truth. It bears all things, believes all things, hopes all things, endures all things. Love never fails. The word of the Lord. Now join your right hands, which you already have, and declare your consent before God and his church. I, Matt, take you, Claire, to be my wife. I, Matt, take you, Claire, to be my wife. I promise to be true to you. I promise to be true to you. In good times and in bad. In good times and in bad. In sickness and in health. In sickness and in health. I will love you and honor you. I will love you and honor you. All the days of my life. All the days of my life. I, Claire, take you, Matt, to be my husband. I, Claire, take you, Matt, to be my husband. I promise to be true to you. I promise to be true to you. In good times and in bad. In good times and in bad. In sickness and in health. In sickness and in health. I will love you and honor you. I will love you and honor you. All the days of my life. All the days of my life. I want to honor you, mother. And I want to learn from your power. I want to steal your attention like a bad outlaw and I want to stand out in the crowd for you A man among men I want to make your world better than it's ever been And I'm gonna love like nobody loves you And I learn your trust making memories of us We'll follow the rainbow Wherever the four winds blow and There'll be a new Consent before the church. May the Lord in His goodness strengthen your consent and fill you both with His blessing. What God has joined, man must not divide. Don't know what to do Cause 
Every time I try to tell her I feel it comes out I love you You got whatever it is That's how I feel Cause when she loves me I'm on top of the world Cause when she loves me No, I can live forever And when she loves me I am untouchable Oh yeah, no one can see that. It's so pretty. It goes me away Everything I want to say to a woman But I couldn't find the words to say She got whatever it is I don't know what to do Cause every time I try to tell her I feel it comes out I love you, I do She got whatever it is It blows me away She's everything I want to say to a woman But I couldn't find the words to say She got whatever it is I don't know what to do Cause every time I try to tell her I feel it comes out I love you You got whatever it is You know I've never been the type They would ever want to stay Bring them home at night And they're gone the next day But that all changed When she walked into my life and people ask them why it is, tell them I don't know That just something about the woman makes my heart go haywire She's gonna be my wife She got whatever it is, it blows me away She's everything I wanna say to a woman But I couldn't find the words to say She got whatever it is, I don't know what to do Every time I try to tell her I feel it comes out I love you You got whatever it is Oh, you got whatever it is You got whatever it is At this time, it is my honor as well as my privilege to introduce to you all for the second time in public as husband and wife this is the new mr and mrs matthew and claire framu A huge round of applause for our beautiful bride and groom, the newlyweds! I want to tell you how special it was a year ago today that uh, Matt proposed to Claire. So it's a very special time, obviously, because this was a very nice proposal in the Bahamas, if I recall. Gladly she accepted and agreed to be not just his wife, but a part of our family. So for that, I would like to thank her mother and father for raising such a wonderful girl, and we are so blessed to have her in our family. So thank you for sharing her. <laughs> and we promise you that we will treat her as a daughter and we'll love her and care for her like she's our own, because now she is. So we love you, Claire. No more crying. <laughs> no more crying, I promise. <laughs> love you. It's always made me very nervous with Matt, because if you don't know Matt, he is we talked about earlier, the most kind, giving, caring person you, you honestly will ever meet, and, and almost to a fault. He actually gave me a call one day, and um, tells me about this gorgeous girl he hung out with. He said he had the best time of his life. Um, but what I found was really cool was, uh, he didn't really talk much about Saturday night, as opposed to how him and Claire went to church the next morning. 
I think we definitely are in the presence of true love. And to be honest with you, Matt's not the only lucky one today. We're all lucky to have Claire in our lives. And I want to start off by saying that every once in a while, you know, two people meet and you just know that it's meant to be. You know instantly that the stars have aligned and that their paths would bring them together uh, regardless of what the world may throw their way. And this was clearly the case nine years ago when Claire and I first met. Um, <laughs> in all seriousness, if you're lucky enough to be someone who spends any amount of time with Claire, then you know that she is someone who loves with no conditions and is so eager to be a generous friend with her time and her attention. Claire's also fiercely loyal to those that she cares for, fiercely. She's one of the few people I know whose default is kindness and who radiates positivity. I thought that I had never met anyone kinder, uh, more generous with her attention and time, or easier to be friends with with Claire and then Claire and then I met Matt. And I'm here to tell you that she's truly met her match truly and someone who has never met a stranger and is just so eager to connect with people he has just met and with those that he's loved his entire life and I couldn't be happier that she's found um, the perfect husband. You know Matt is the kind of person who takes real good care of the people that he loves and I am glad that that now encompasses Claire um, and my whole family. Um, so, I'm like awkwardly standing with my back to you right now. So, <laughs> as I said, Claire likes to think about everyone else and she forgets about herself. So I'm glad there is somebody to remember about her and to show her the love that she deserves and that she gives to everybody else in the whole wide world. I am so happy that she found somebody to take care of her in the way that she deserves. And so, I am very excited to welcome Matt into my family and he is my new brother and I'm about to cry so I'm going to sit down and I also forgot my drink so everybody raise your glass! <laughs> when Claire was three I came home from work one day and Claire was locked in the bathroom with a rope going between the bathroom door and the closet door and both doors opened in. So Claire was trapped. <laughs> so, you know, I come home, nobody's around, walk through the hall and see the rope, and knock on the bathroom door and find out the whole story. Apparently, Claire had told her brothers, after they locked her in the bathroom, that she didn't care, she would eat toothpaste. <laughs> you keep God in front of your, your relationship, Keep them involved, and you will have a long and happy marriage. That's what I want to give to you. That's what kept our marriage long and happy. So, love each other. Keep God centered, and you will have a long and happy marriage. To Claire and Matt, for the long haul. Claire, um... When we did the father-daughter dance, uh, you really tickled me when you started ribbing me about not having grandchildren right away. Uh, that certainly is your prerogative, but it was really, really funny to do it then. So uh, I wish you Matt and Matt the best, but I do expect grandchildren at some point or other. Thank you so much. Love you, Dad. Matt, I am so overwhelmed with feelings of emotion right now and it's really just my sheer joy and happiness for the life that you've chosen for yourself and the beautiful woman that you've chosen to be by your side in your life's journey and just know that my tears are of pure joy and happiness for you and I wanted to know you to know how proud I am of the man you've become and how I know you will love and cherish Claire for all of your days and I just wanted you to know how much I love you I am your mom I love you forever. I'll like you for always. As long as I'm living, my baby you'll be. Your love is bright as ever. Even in the shadows. Baby, kiss me. Before they turn the lights out. Your heart is glowing And 
Teresa, three years ago today, the first time I ever saw you, I knew that I really wanted to spend the rest of my life with you. Claire, seven years from now, we're going to look off on our family and we're going to see the lives that we created. And me and you are going to realize where you came from and I love you. And I love you. So my favorite part of the ceremony was seeing Matt for the first time and saying the vows. I think they're really big words and I mean every one of them. I'm gonna love you.